we're back for the NAB Show Centennial Event, the pinnacle event for all in the global broadcast, media, and entertainment industry. Capitalize, content, and create. We've got everything you could possibly need right here in Vegas. Ashley within Broadcast. Joining me is Paul of Adamus. Hello. Oh yeah, nice to see you. Nice to see you. So, Paul, can you tell me where does Adamus land right now as far as broadcast and media industry? Well, we've made a massive transition because we've got, now got a whole lot of new products on top of our existing products, which are now connected products. So we have Zato Connect, we have uh, Ninja 5 and Ninja 5 Plus with the Atomus Connect module, and we have the Shogun Connect behind us here. These three products, particularly in the now connected workflow, now work seamlessly with our new cloud, Atomus Cloud Studio, which is a whole suite, it's a gateway really, to a whole suite of different services. So that's the massive change from Atomus that we now have a really solid hardware business but now we're connecting to brand new services within the cloud. And what trends have you noticed currently? Well, the, one of the massive changes has been obviously within the, driven by the cloud and virtual sort of uh, remote working is that we, when we, we launched the camera to cloud with Frame.io and Adobe, which was a few months ago, the use of media, the one trying to get inst media instantly into the cloud, people start working on it anywhere in the world and getting that content up on a social network, particularly as quick, as quick as possible. So we've got the gateway for that with obviously all the services now we offer. So, so many things to speak on. Um, I know you touched on some of the new products a little bit and developments, but can you go in depth a little bit more on some of the things behind me? Yeah, so the things behind me, so we've split the booth up into a few different sections, so it's quite easy to sort of separate them out. So really now with our connected products, you've got Atoms Cloud Studio, as I say, is the gateway. Uh, we already, using that gateway, we can take our devices and put them into live streaming to all the social platforms. We can go into camera to cloud, Adobe camera to cloud, powered by Frame.io. Been super, super successful. And we've just launched a brand new feature with that, where it's called progressive upload. So whereas before you'd have to wait till the, you'd stop recording and then the proxy file would go up into the cloud. Now it starts to go up to the cloud as you're actually recording. So for a long form recording, like say an hour or two clip, it can still only take like a minute and a half, two minutes to get that clip in and frame IO and someone working on it straight away anywhere in the world and start editing it and publishing it. So that's the really massive, massive change for camera to cloud. We also announced uh, literally a few days ago another platform which is Sony CI Cloud, Sony CI Media. And that now is another destination for our Connect products to link to as an alternative platform for this capture to cloud, camera to cloud workflow. So that's a really exciting new news. Uh, then we can then link as a completely sort of separate spin, but using the same products, the same cloud, we have a whole live production suite. So the second part of the booth is big demos on that, where we can literally take our connected products with any HDMI camera, any SDI camera, and bring it into a live production. So a multi-camera environment with all of the features that you normally find outside on an outside broadcast truck, but all running in the cloud virtually, like vision mixer, graphics, audio mixer, talkback, tally, all that is now running in the cloud, all from an Atomus device. So all of those features of someone using the same camera, the same Atomus Connect, say like the Shogun Connect, uh, they've now got tally talkback and a video source into a live production. And then the third thing we've just announced, which really rounds off our offering from the cloud studio and shows how broad you can make these offerings. This is the massive pivot for Atomus really, is that you've now got Atomus Cloud Edit. So we've now got an edit platform which is web browser, web browser based. So again, it can be just launched on any web browser, anyone in the world, and we can get content directly off the camera through the Connect, Atomus Cloud Studio. We're now in an edit where the, the material is directly coming into the timeline. You can now do rough cuts. You, you, you can cut everything together, package it all up, top and tail it with titles, graphics, uh, you know, transitions, and directly publish to YouTube or Vimeo, for instance, or even export to an LLE with an XML. So we've now got the complete end-to-end -end solution with all of our connected stuff and Atomist Cloud Studio. Do you want to speak any bit about what we might expect from you in the near future? Well, we'll definitely be getting more and more connected physical products, but we'll see a load more features that we're going to be launching for Atomus Cloud Studio because, as I say, it, it's, a, it's a gateway to lots of cloud services. We're, we're very big on partnering 
with best of breed companies in other spaces that we're not in. And now the cloud is a perfect way of getting all those other type of workflows in, connecting to our cloud and our cloud team, which keeps it, we can then move so much quicker. And because we have that really solid interface between our hardware and the Atomos cloud, we can move really, really quickly with all the new stuff. Well, that was very informative. I love visiting your booth. Thank you so much. Thank you.